ladies and gentlemen, Silent Mike, we got another little workout video, a training session at the one and only Barba Brigade. Just showing you guys the real Harlem Shake. I don't know if you guys remember that. You might be too old, but that's that's the the new age. There it is. There it is. The Harlem Shake. Look it up. That's the real Harlem Shake, not the little viral one. I'm at Barber Brigade hitting a little bit of upper body and lower body with my man, Bart Kwan, my really good friend and owner of Barber Brigade. Um, so Bart is competing. He has a meet, um, I think only about two or three weeks out. Basically, all the employees of Barber Brigade are competing in it, which is super cool. I actually have a wedding to go to that day. Otherwise, I would go down there uh, and show my support because literally the entire staff, people that have never competed before, everybody's trying to throw down. So I just basically hopped in with Bart. Um, he was hitting some squats, and as many of you know, uh, look at that talent. Can you look at that balance? But Bart wanted to switch squat racks so he could be closer to me because I was doing the belt squat. I walked the entire gym, no hands, 45 pounds in my in my hands, barbell on my neck, rack to rack, rack to rack. I didn't know. He, I don't think he helped me. Oh, maybe he did. I thought he didn't help me, and I racked that thing perfectly on my little baby traps. But uh, so I'm, I'm not squatting or deadlifting. I'm basically just giving my back a break, and, and more importantly, my mind a break. As I've been dieting, I'm, I'm feeling literally the leanest and meanest, most vascular I've ever been around 200 to 205 pounds. And it's been a great mental break for me to just kind of do whatever I want to do. Um, I still have some structure in my workouts, but I'm doing cardio. I'm going for bike rides. I'm doing a little extra cardio. I'm going in on the gym on the off days because I feel like it because I want to do extra cardio because I want to do extra arms or whatever it might be. Uh, and it's been a really good break for my brain not to solely be focused on the numbers that I used to hit or when I'm peaked or my best, you know, five rep max or whatever it might be in a variation of the squat bench or deadlift. So uh, I will return to powerlifting. I have zero doubts in my head. I will hit bigger, better numbers at lower body weights than I've ever hit in my life. But for now, I'm enjoying the process. I've talked a little bit on Instagram for those that are not following me there is Salam Michael 2 ks but I talked about uh, the many projects that I got going on and, and we're just laying the foundation for these things. So it's a little bit of a struggle period mentally for me because progress can't always be seen. You're, you're constantly working and grooving on these things, uh, but the results don't come. You know, the patience is where it really comes into play. I'm a super impatient person. You know, I'm, I'm always eyes on the prize kind of deal, but uh, it's very difficult at times. So um, I'm doing a max effort pit shark and, and Bart's just, he's really holding on to me. Uh, you, you know, I, I don't know if you guys have ever been hugged by an angel um but this was i did two reps i basically did two reps and he and he, and he, he coddled my my behind my, my goocher and, and allowed me to really push through that's the progressive overload we're looking for uh but so we got a lot of projects going stress is is is, is high in kind of the business life sense um but in the gym and things it's good um bart was trying to get a real workout and i'm just being an idiot i'm doing my parkour uh hardcore parkour plus some pitch shark after this i actually do get a decent workout in it was just in the beginning uh it was like probably six or seven in the morning something stupid I, I drank too much caffeine and started messing around but uh, i think bart hit a heavy single and then some back off sets of five i just did some um sets of five to eight on the pitch shark and then pretty much called it for the lower body um we did end up getting a nice upper body pump uh i think we did a bunch of chin-ups bart's super good at them so it's good to do those with him it makes me push myself a little bit um i did some dumbbell incline press some side lateral raises and just a little bit of arms when i'm traveling just try to get a pump try to feel good <laughs> it was a mess at the gym appreciate you guys give this video a thumbs up new videos coming every tuesday wednesday thursday a saturday a sunday i will be back on twitch as soon as i'm back from texas check out mama's boys podcast on itunes two new episodes a week i think you guys will really love it the feedback's been great i appreciate all you guys catch you in the next one